Bobby I have, and uh, now live by satellite, a man whose movie Kickbox is one of the biggest videos of all time, and his new film, A Well Opens Today, Jean-Claude Van Damme. Uh, Jean-Claude, uh, apparently you're not too pleased about uh, the name AWOL being used, yeah, are you? one, two, three, how are you? Everything is fine. <laughs> oh. Jean-Claude. Jean-Claude, yeah. a lot of people are tipping you to, you know, be the new Arnold Schwarzenegger over there in America. Yeah. Are you a violent man, though? Do I look violent to you, Terry? Uh, in your movies you do, yeah. Oh, in a movie. Because I'm an actor. I'm a very nice guy. One day we'll meet in London, we'll have a couple of drinks together. What? And then you'll give me a kick in? No, not you. you yeah, I've got your picture here on, on the front, you know? I can see you. You look like a nice guy to me. <laughs> I'm beginning to like you more and more all the time now. Uh, Thank so, you. Tell me, how, how long did you actually train in martial arts for? I started uh, karate when I was nine years old. So it took me a long, long time. I'm 29 now. Did you actually, you know, fight a lot when you were a kid? With other, with other children? Oh, uh, no, I was running too fast. <laughs> well, you didn't have fights when you were young. Yeah, I was fighting sometimes for a couple of girls, you know. <laughs> <laughs> well, being in Los Angeles, you're certainly in the right place for that. Um, yeah. <laughs> but did, you, you actually played the Predator, uh, opposite Arnold Schwarzenegger, in the film Predator. Uh, how did you get on with Arnold? He's a wonderful guy, but uh, in that time, I was a stunt guy. He was an actor. So we didn't see too much of each other. And uh, that movie gave me my uh, side card, Screen Actors Guild. That's why I did it. <laughs> I mean, somebody told me that you actually didn't really get on with him very well. Who told you that? <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll send you his name and address in the post. <laughs> Please. No, he's a wonderful guy. <laughs> I mean, I mean, with a lot of the movies that you've made, I mean, obviously, uh, you know, the best thing about them is a lot of the choreography and stuff. Uh, you, your most recent one is a bit different to that. But how do you feel when you find out that children uh, actually copy, you know, the kind of things that you do in your films and they actually have a fight in a school playground? Mm, I think, you know, kids, they like, they like to see a guy who can help himself in, ra in, in, in real life, real situation with uh, natural weapons, mm -hmm. you know? And I think it's beautiful, it's, it's, it's an art also, it's a, it's a sport, and karate, it's very big right now. Mm. But, but I mean, if uh, one child hurts another child by copying something they've seen you do in a film, does that make you feel a bit responsible? Uh, Jesus, then I'm very responsible all over the world. <laughs> Now, uh, what, what's on the cards now for Jean-Claude Van Damme? Because you're trying to move away from martial arts films, aren't you? No, I came, I came in this country with my legs, karate, like Arnold came with his muscles. And right away, those movies made fantastic at the box office. And I established a relationship between me and the audience. And now I'm moving to different types of movies with better script, better casting, and of course, it's more money. <laughs> well, I, can't, I haven't got time to ask you how you'll spend it. Thanks a lot for talking to us, Jean-Claude, and uh, good luck in the future. And, uh, Thanks, Terry. And if you come to London, I'll suss out who that guy was who told me he didn't get on with Arnie. I'll find his you name. You know what? <laughs> Tell him you believe him. That's <laughs> okay. the best way to go. <laughs> Thanks a lot. All right. Uh, we'll, we'll have a quick look at this week's gossip now as we go on another mission.